The Leroy Chow and Russian engineer Slizan Shapirov have made final inspections of the Soyuz rocket craft that will blast them up to the orbiting International Space Station on Thursday. The main mission of their six-month tour of duty will be to prepare the ISS for the eventual return of American space shuttles. They replace Russian Gennady Padalka and American Michael Fink, who've been in orbit since April. The launch of Expedition 10 was delayed due to technical problems with the docking craft, but engineers and crews say everything is now set. Russian resupply ships have been the only link with the ISS since the U.S. shuttle fleet was grounded following the Space Shuttle Columbia disaster 16 months ago. Well, we started this program with news on French culture year. Marking its opening, renowned musician Jean-Michel Jarre staged a spectacular concert at the Forbidden City in the very heart of Beijing. Wang Yinning went to the performance and filed this report. War begun is half done. Everyone at Jean-Michel Jacques Meridian Gate concert was in no doubt of the French culture year in Beijing. The concert opened with an exotic melody which seemed to come from another planet. Yes, of course, Jean-Michel Jacques is uh, uh, still a young artist, a French artist, who is extremely clever, makes beautiful music and uh, very interestingly uses new technology to make beautiful music. The 19 pieces performed at the concert depict Jean's personal understanding about space, fine arts and the charm of lights. It's great to hold a modern concert at our traditional architectural site. It's a good idea to show the world how fantastic our cultural heritage is. This is my first Jean-Michel Jacques concert. I believe his talent is worthy of a personal concert at such a wonderful place, the Meridian Gate. Back in Jacques were nearly 250 Chinese musicians from the local symphony orchestra and chorus. And Chinese soprano Yong Hongfei let her voice soar. Or they showed the meaning of the French culture here, friendship. The concert confirms the perfect combination of the modern electronic music and Chinese traditional architectural art. And Jean-Michel Jacques' successful performance indicates a very good beginning of the France culture year in China. Wang Yanning, CCTV. And we finish off in the U.S. where dozens of married couples...